Hey everybody, this is Grimcad, and today we're going to be starting a little Torchlight 2. We're going to see how this one goes. We're going to be doing it on the hardest difficulty and on hardcore. So whenever our character dies, our character dies. I haven't beaten this game. But generally with a game like this, it's only a matter of time until you beat it. That's when not on Hardcore. We'll see what happens on Hardcore. Uh, we're gonna play as an engineer. They're the big two-handed guy. Oh man, I like that. Look at that big old mustache right there. That was pretty awesome too. Ah, we're doing that one. Very steampunky, Torchlight 2. I'm not going to talk too much about it. I, I, I don't really like... It's a game that's been out for quite a while. If you see what you like, you should pick it up, but... Look at that flaming red hair. Not really flaming red, but red nonetheless. And I got a little ferret. We're going to be Grimcad, which makes sense. Select a pet. I haven't actually played this in a long time, and there are way more pets than the first time that I played it. Um, must have gotten patched or something. Because before it was just like, I think the ferret, the dog, the cat, maybe the bulldog. That sounds about right. And then there's a wolf and a panda. Gosh, it's a big panda. <laughs> An owl. Silly little badger. Oh my gosh, there's a head crab. Um, I think I'm gonna do the head cat, crab, aim shadow. I don't think so. I think we're gonna have. Ooh, Rodden. Gordon. Freeman. Gordon Freeman the head crab. I like that. We're gonna do hardcore mode, and we're gonna be elite. Doing this on single player. don't want to play with any of my friends. <laughs> and I reckon I'll Deep, be quiet. Neath torchlight, a darkness gathered. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be Three playing real well. Confronted the beast called That's Orca. annoying. We're gonna skip that. Maybe it's something with the recorder I'm using that it didn't like. Ah, it doesn't like running this game at all, actually. It's a little choppy. I think this is as far as I can go. Hmm. You should carry on to the Asterian Enclave, but you're on your own. Warn them that the Alchemist destroyed Torchlight and is headed their way. He may be there already. I bet he is. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Torchlight is basically a Diablo clone. Came out a little while before Diablo 3, and it has done pretty well. It's about... Oh gosh, those things hit hard. I mean, I hit hard, but... Oof. This is running a little slow, because I'm not on my normal computer. Unfortunately, my normal computer... The ones that I was doing all my other recording on has... We're gonna heal up died and I need to buy a new version of Windows. Somehow my version of Windows got corrupted. I have no idea. Man, that takes a lot of hits on this difficulty. We're gonna remember, we're gonna have to be cautious, 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 cautious. Use those skills. Use my boom hammer right now. Oof. Oh my gosh. I don't have enough mana. These things are wrecking me. Go, Gordon. Protect your master. Look like 
Gordon hit for no damage right there. That's... Oh! Suck him to the face! Yeah, and I'm level two. You guys should be frightened. Alright, here's a little bit about how this works. There's a little charge meter down here. Anytime I hit somebody, it charges up a little bit. Whenever I use my right mouse button, which is Flame Hammer, it uses up a charge, or multiple charges, and becomes a little bit more powerful. I picked up a much more powerful weapon. We're gonna go ahead and level up, pop everything into strength. Because that's how we roll. Pop back into our first skill, the Doom Hammer. Boom Hammer. Doom Hammer is what? World of Warcraft? Yeah. I like the way this game looks. Um, it doesn't have to be. I don't quite know what I want to say. The game looks very polished for what it is. And, you know, I don't even want to say the phrase for what it is, because what it is is a nice game. Uh, that sounds like uh, I'm cheapening it when I say for what it is. Um, if you want to take that as... <laughs> for not being Diablo, you know, I grew up in... 80s and 90s, Diablo was the first one. Huge, huge game, Diablo. Talking about Diablo 1, not Diablo 2. But I played a ton of Diablo 2. And so that's kind of my bread and butter when I think of games of this style. And I think pretty much everybody else thinks of too. You know, things are called Diablo clones for a reason. them barrels up. Hmm. A little lost. Every time I see Gordon Freeman back there, I think he's a bad guy. <laughs> I think he's sneaking up on me. I think our friend is going to be staying mobile in this one. Get a couple of hits in, drop back, let your pet do some of the damage. Keeping a healthy, healthy, healthy supply of potions, too. Spark Ember spec. One thing I do know about these ones, these are equipable gem slots, is to go ahead and use these slots. Because they tend to drop fairly quickly. Yeah, there's no reason to save them up. I don't think you can actually combine them in this game like you could the first. So you've got absolutely no reason not to. And it's hard. I hit pretty hard too, but I don't hit hard like they hit hard. I do like that effect though. The boom hammer. I think shattering shields is a pretty cool mechanic too. That'll help you. Oh man. You might be on your own. <laughs> Get away from that guy. There's a three. Hot dog. Where'd that guy go? This wasn't quite done, was it? You just get here? I just get here. Uh, let's see. Let's 
We're actually gonna pick up the thing for my pet, because I know the reward for the end of our mission right here is gonna be an awesome hammer. Or weapon, anyway, so no reason to get a slightly better weapon when we're gonna be getting a much better one slightly later. I, I know I picked up a key. And I'm not going to use it instantly. I'm going to save it for later. You know, your first chest. Probably not going to be that great. You know, I don't know what to tell you. You got a... Level 1 chest, as it were. You might want to pass it off for the opportunity to, uh... Unlock the level 5 chest. Just saying. A lot of explosions. I hope they're not too loud. Uh, we might have to edit future videos of this. Fortunately, I think I'm also gonna have to uh, lower the graphics settings a little bit. Because it is just not doing it for me. Not quite smooth enough. Yeah. I'm real big on those uh, frame rates. I'm trying to smack me, I'm trying to loot this. Boom! Yeah, not liking it. Um, hmm. We'll play to the end of where I planned on playing today, and then I'm gonna. I'm gonna have to kill the quality, I believe. Yeah. Get a bunch of uh, points, too. Might as well level up. Put that all in the strength, because that's how we roll. Pick up that boom hammer, because that's how we roll. I thank you for your warning, but it has arrived too late. This alchemist has already come and gone. And it was all I could do to prevent him from entering the Enclave. As it was, many Estellians were injured. And since the confrontation, several more have become ill. We are not sure what is causing it. After his assault failed Excuse here, me. the Alchemist carried on southward toward the Temple Steps. Commander Vale and her vanquishers arrived a short while later and pursued him, hoping to prevent further damage. Okay, see? That's right what I was talking about. We're going two hands all the way. The Vampiric War Caber. Enchanted Great Hammer. If I am not mistaken... Commander Vale believes that the Alchemist might attack the oh, Wellspring wait. Temple in an attempt to reach the Guardian of Water. For what nefarious purpose I am afraid to speculate. There has been no word from either Vale or the Guardian. Scout the Wellspring Temple and determine if the Guardian of Water is in any danger. We'll see what we can do. You guess I am. Instantly forgot what I was going to say. No, uh... I didn't, actually. I believe that all of the quest weapons are also... <laughs> sorry. <laughs> randomly generated. So every time you play through, you'll get something slightly different. That's pretty cool. I am at your service. Wow, look at that. It's an augmented bone maul. Augmented weapon, kill ten champion creatures to upgrade? I have no idea what that means. I, I don't even know. Requires level 14 or 32 strength and 13 focus. But, man, that's so cool. I wants it. I wants it now. I can't afford that. It sells for 55. I couldn't strip myself naked and still buy it. I'm waiting to actually put this into a weapon because I don't think electric armor is really going to do much for me at this point. Ah, that is... I didn't know there was such a thing in 
this game is augmented stuff. Like I said, I didn't play through a ton of it. That's cool. One of the other really cool things about this game is that there are a bunch of mods out for it. Um, all sorts of things. Uh, different classes, so I'm probably going to be running Five through minutes. different classes as well. Um, I'm pretty excited for that. They're not necessarily balanced <laughs> from what I've seen, but I figure we'll burn that bridge later on. You have received a quest. <laughs> quest before I figure out the war. Did I sell? I did. Yeah, I'm. I think I'm only getting about 15 frames per second. Uh, closer to 20, but still, that's that's annoying. That's very annoying. It's annoying as these skeletal warriors with those shields. Taking like three hits. Bell. Man, we're just slogging it. Oh god! We almost died already. Oh my god, those things are making more and more of them. So. <laughs> That is awful. That was rough. Real rough. Oof. Man, am I gonna have to go back and buy potions? That's crazy. I don't think I've ever bought potions in a game like this. Normally they throw them at you fast and furious. Oof. The boom hammer! I wish I could jump up there. Oh gosh, I didn't kill those things. Yeah, look at that. That... Gordon, you're not... You're doing barely any damage. I'm afraid it's time for you to go. Get better. Start a training montage or something. This is this is awful. How are you supposed to get the brains? If you can't, you know. You have gained experience. Get the brains. Gosh. That's such a cool attack. That hammer. Oof. Feels so heavy when you're swinging it. All right, what was that other thing that it said? Focus. Focus is like magic and stuff. All right, pump five into vitality. Let us. We can't pick up the next thing—a flame hammer. Well, I might as well hover over this so you guys can actually see what flame hammer does. Uh, we'll talk a little about skills, actually. Um, you can see here there are three different tiers you can unlock by putting points into them and then each tier has bonuses that you can see right there what we're we gonna get we're not even gonna use shields we'll, we'll probably never put a single point now that's probably not true we'll probably emits a force field awesome we're gonna get the healing bot because yeah, I feel that's the way to go. We're gonna knock it there. We're gonna summon him. This little guy's gonna follow us and keep us healed. Men for the uh, corrupted crypt right up there. I think we'll uh, maybe clear that out and call it a day. I don't know. Maybe call it a day a little bit before, depending on how much this bothers me. I mean, it. Frame rate thing really is an issue. <laughs> if it's an issue for me, it's probably an issue for you guys. That's the only reason I made a big deal about it. That's terrible. That's awful. 
this game isn't tough to run. But I'm on a laptop and I'm, you know, uh, straight from the computer, or not computer, <laughs> straight from the store laptop. It's just oof, running rough. Give me a quest, old woman. Oop. Wait, old woman. Can I equip that thing yet? No, it requires level 6 for 27 strength. Oh, man. I could have equipped that if I would have put the points into. Oh, well. I need your help. Yeah, uh, I don't think I'm gonna read this text. We'll see what happens. Unless somebody's clamoring for me to, and uh, to be honest, I kind of doubt somebody will be. Two health stone, thirteen electric damage. Yeah, Gordon Freeman, you're not gonna be awful by the end of this quest, I don't think. We'll see. Don't leave your ember. Thank you. Yeah, that's like... Oh, there's the damage. 27 to 37 damage. Whereas I... Do like 40-some? I do 52 to 105 damage? And... Ugh. Yeah, big difference. I don't even know why you're here, Gordon Freeman. Yeah. Oh yeah, we'll equip that, and then we can equip that. Awesome! Um, is that the right thing? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's totally the right choice. Look, and now our uh, mall has this purplish glow to it. And we're draining hit. Drain in health on hits. Not much health, I don't think. Like 2%? Oh, 4 health. It's a flat number, huh? That'll help keep me alive a little bit with <laughs> some luck. Oh boy. Too bad it doesn't give me four health every one of those hits. Two hundred. Two hundred. I, I was that was kind of hoping it would give it to me for smashing the urn. That's kind of cheap, I know, but you know. Sometimes you gotta cheat. Hurling axes. Picked up a ring, I think, that's not identified, yeah. Ooh. It's part of a set. Gives me armor, not bad. Elemental armor. Oh, good time to kill. big old door. Man, oh man, I'm... Are there town portal scrolls and all that? Yeah, okay. Oh, well, no wonder I'm so hurt. I completely forgot to summon... Um... The Healing Bot. I think we're eventually gonna have to come up with a name for Healing Bot. Oop. Headless Shrieker... Dividing? Stop it. Tar Cloth? Man, I don't... Mm. <laughs> Would you start healing me? There we go. 
There we go. That wasn't so bad. Alright. I know the second I open this chest, things are gonna... Yep. <laughs> yep. It's alright. I'm just gonna keep bobbing and weaving. That's right. That's how we do it. Give me that mana potion. You know that I, that's what I need. Yep. Don't see if I have any choice. We'll try to stay to this side, though. We saw how nasty that other side is. I did not mean to turn the other direction. That is awful. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Please don't crush me. I'm out of potions. Stupid head. Oh, goodness. What just happened? <laughs> it's split into two. That is awful. It's the troll hammer. Oh. And a health potion, which we will immediately use. Oh. That was rough. Oh boy. Remember, you gotta do bottom wing, bottom wing. Those are those dividing things or whatever. Yeah, super annoying. Really, really cool mechanic. <laughs> super annoying. An electric ring. Ooh, I got all sorts of things. Yup. Yeah. Can't use it. Yeah, that's uh, another piece of that uh, set too, I think. Yeah, hey, look at that, plus three attack speed. Ah, uh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh, right. Hmm. Turn that into a new. Show helmet? No show helmet. I don't think we're gonna show that helmet. I think we look too awesome with our red hair to show that helmet. <laughs> well, yeah, we better level up too, huh? Then we can get rid of that one thing. How much should I just level up? What happened? <laughs> We're gonna do that one. Into the other. Was it some boots? Yes, it was boots. Yeah. So now I've got the boots of giving me more health. I'm glad of that. Just smashing our way through the undead. Sort of. Sweeping hammer strike. Be awesome. Yeah, see, 
now I feel, uh, now I feel as if we're at an appropriate level for this. Doing our job. Ah, those things are throwing their heads at me. What is up with that treasure chest? <laughs> what is up with that treasure chest? Oh my god, there's ghosts that are attacking me. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. One of them's over there. I can't even get to it. I guess after I kill this, it'll... Yep. Sure looked like it. Now the kicker is going to be if it's trapped. Okay. Ghastly. Three pieces of ghastly. That's pretty cool. So as long as anything says ghastly, so it's part of a set, but not really part of a set, it's part of a random set, that's pretty awesome. Hmm, yes. Those ringed pans. Uh, before we go down, we're gonna clear out the level. That one. Oh, Sully, my cat just sneezed on me. Weapons rack, give me anything good. <laughs> okay, it's a shotgun and a pistol. I guess it could be much worse. Much more to this level than I thought there was. I thought we were right at the end of it. It looks like it goes on a bit further. <laughs> I just saved you, Gordon Freeman. You remember that later on. I didn't put in another skill. Hmm. I still don't have an unlock for that. <laughs> do I want to do that? Or this? Gosh, I, I gotta go with that stun chance. It's low right now, but eventually it'll get up there. And I think a stun is just what I need. This is supposed to be the easy part of the game. I'm kind of getting my butt kicked. I don't know what I'm going to do when I come up against the bosses. We'll go down to the next level, and we'll... <laughs> we'll probably find an answer to that question fairly soon. Because there's a mini-boss here. Well... Sort of a mini boss. A champion version, whatever. Uh, we're gonna have to summon our healing bot. Heal me. Skeleton General's beat me up. Oh man, so many hits. Crooked blade. You have hey. gained an experience. Well, oh, so when I leveled up, it identified all my unleveled items? That's pretty cool. I don't think it really had much that wasn't identified, but there you go.
do that strength because that's what we like. Yeah, look at that. We're doing 77 to 158 damage. And we can put stuff back into Flame Hammer. Which is now doing 80% of our weapons damage. It doesn't seem like it's much. Eh. Guess it'll be alright. Seems to certainly be doing the job thus far. Those are those things that's a farmer shot a gun. Gone. Kind of a completionist. <laughs> I like to reveal all the map. There we go, that was much better. More of those dividing SOBs. <laughs> he's unique too, you can tell because he's got a name. And a purple health bar. He's gonna be the same annoying ugh, dividing thing. He knocks me back every time he hits me. Ooh, heal up. Oh, they're both champions too. Fantastic. I and I could have guessed it would have worked like that. Not enough mana. Use up some mana. Potions. Ah, oh, that did give me a lot of fame. Ooh, which leads me to the next point I should talk about. Fame. Um, in addition to experience, every character also has fame. Every time you get a level up with fame, you wind up getting some more, I think, skill points to put into things. So it's kind of cool. Another way to help you become a little bit stronger. Um, you earn fame by completing quests from NPCs and by killing the rare and champion versions of enemies. It was a bat, I didn't really even see the Oh gosh. Can't I just uh Oh my gosh, I can cheat. Do we wanna cheat? Is, is that a is that a question? <laughs> uh. Teleporting bats. See if there's a treasure chest up here before we pull this lever. <laughs> Inventory is full. What? Okay. Here's the next thing we're gonna learn. Okay, after we go over everything. <laughs> yeah, can't really use that. Oh, nice! There is the last piece of that set. Fantastic! Now we have 12% health, 3% attack speed, more strength, more health from the regular. Nope, I'm using two-handed stuff. We have something way better. What I'm doing right now is everything that I don't want, I'm switching over to my pet's inventory. One of the neat things is that you can send your pet to go sell your items for you. I oh, still don't have that. Yeah, the focus, of course, that makes sense. I haven't pumped anything into focus. I wish I had a weapon I could throw those things into. Um, oh well. 
It's got a mana pool. I didn't know your pet could cast spells. That's interesting. And anyway, we send this button right here and say send your pet, pet to pet town. Departed. It'll be gone for 50 seconds. And this 50 seconds. Oh, really? We're gonna use the cheese. I feel bad about it. Dude, I feel awful about it. I'm not gonna do it anymore. <laughs> We're gonna wait for the pet to come back. We're gonna wait for the mana. Huh. S and Z automatically use mana potions. The best one. Come on. Come on. Man, it's a head crap. Oh, interesting. So if I wind up getting into Your a bind or something. Returned. And brought me almost a thousand gold. Way to go, Gordon. You ready for this? Oh god, there's little things that kill me. Your oh my god, Gordon, are you dead? Shift Z, which automatically uses a potion for your pet. Gordon, get the hell in there. Do some damage. Mana potion up. Hit him once for real. Oh my god, stay away from that guy. Oh. I don't see how that killed him either. I feel like I got knocked back 50 things and... <laughs> 50 what? feet. And it was just like, you know what? You can have this. <laughs> well, let's clear the rest of the level. See if there's any sweet loot to get. Pillage of all the sarcophagi, the hand bumper. <laughs> um, I tend not to, even though I clear the level, I try not to pick up every single piece of everything I can find. So, I'll probably just be picking up magic stuff. Bell Elemental Overload. I will touch on that in a second. Oh gosh. What? Okay. Whoops. There are spells that every single class can use that randomly drop. This one is called Elemental Overload, as you can see. I can read the scroll, it adds it to my spells, um, four at a time I think you can hold, you come up with different versions so you'll find elemental overload 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, etc. Does different things there in addition to my class specific ones. Pretty cool. So this increases all my elemental damage. Do I even do any elemental damage? I don't I don't think I do. I didn't really mean to use that. I wanted to I look cool and glowy. I suppose that's a thing. This is the end. This is the perfect time to talk to you. <laughs> so, portal to the surface. Old lady. Oh, that is better than my. Hmm. Nope. Warden Freeman sucks. So let's get him better. Yeah, yeah, making a difference. <laughs> All right, let's see what else we got. A lumber axe, worthless. 
Worthless. Worthless. Worthless. Ooh, it's got those two. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see, add 14 to that. And is still worthless. That's not worthless, but it's certainly not as good as what we got. Alright, we're going to. Town portal or waypoint portal. Back to our starting town. Sell our stuff. Buy some potions. If I don't do it now, I'll never I'm remember. At your service. Do you, do you still have that awesome? No, that's not the same thing. It's not. Where's the thingy that augments stuff? It's, it's gone. Where is... Please give it to me. Ah oh, man, I really wanted to see what that did. Ah, I'm not even looking at this stuff. Uh, potions, potions. Probably you. May I assist you? Dynamite. Wow. Fantastic. Oh, potions of elemental resistance. Awesome. I'll pick up another one because we used one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And we'll make it an even ten. That's probably as much as you can know. Whatever, that's probably plenty. Hmm, he sells my pet stuff. Yeah, no. Um, that's interesting. I guess the difference is the 12 to 4 physical armor. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and buy that. No, he sucks slightly less. Nowhere near as good as I am. Look at that, 1995 fame. Ugh. Oh well. Okay, well. We're gonna call this... Glad you made did we do? No, I didn't think we did. <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and call the video here. Thanks for joining me today. This was a long video. I don't necessarily know if all these videos are gonna be this long, but there is a chance that they might be. Uh, thanks you. Thanks you. Thanks to you for joining me today, and peace out.